<sighs> this is weird. All right, folks. Uh, so my name is Cobbler J. I'm a professional street performer all the way here from LaSalle, Ontario currently. That's, that's a good response. All right. Uh, I'm just going to do a couple really quick tricks here. Uh, and I, I want to show, I'm kind of going to kind of showcase my skills in about 10 minutes. Um, so first off, I'm going to do a bit of juggling because uh, I started out juggling. If you guys can't see me from where you're seated, seated that's okay. I'm on the TV. Okay, whatever. All right. So, um, so here we go. I've got a couple apples really quickly. Just going to juggle the, uh, the apples like that. And uh, as always, nobody's really impressed by simple apple juggling. So we'll do some more complicated stuff. So check this out. Uh, okay, some people get jokes. So that's good. All right. Um, uh, that's okay. I can do more. I can actually do a whole lot more. Check it out. I go, uh, I go around this way like this, right? Go back around this way like this. Kind of go both ways just like that, right? Cross my arms over like that. Make eye contact with the camera. Not really worth an applause yet, eh? Is that? Yeah. Okay, good. It's all right. If this doesn't work out, we'll just dub it over with uh, with clap tracks and stuff. So um, I'm going to move on. to the, My favorite ju uh, juggling trick right now uh, is uh, is eating apples while I juggle them. So I've got three apples. I'm going to start juggling them again like this. And I'm going to start by eating the biggest apple, which happens to be uh, this one right here. Okay. So ladies and gentlemen, do me a favor and try to follow this apple right here. All right, if you guys lose it, just remember it's, uh, it's the, big, uh, the big green one. Stands out. It's this, uh, it's this one right here. Actually, I'm going to move the microphone really, really quickly just so I don't bite it um, and damage my teeth further. So here we go. Uh, yep. All right, quick bite, number one. Right. About. Now. <coughs> it's a joke. Um, all right, here we go. Actual bite. Here we go. Quick bite. Right, uh, right about. There you go. There's one. I'm at, I don't know. One. Right. Very good. Um. Thank you guys very much. <laughs> um. <coughs> so, uh, not only am I a juggler, I also do a, a whole bunch of different death-defying, dangerous stunts as well. Um, so I'm going to showcase some of these here. These are actually tricks that I don't often do in my show. Um, so I have these, and these are actually my fire-eating torches. Now, a couple of tricks I'm going to attempt to do with these two torches are set the palm of my hand on fire, set my fingertips on fire, set my tongue on fire, and then actually eat the fire. <laughs> All right, this is working. Cool, cool. Um, now, there, there aren't any kids here, right? Okay, you guys can try this wherever you want them. That's fine. Um, it's really quick. I'm going to douse these in fuel so they light up really, really big. Get a nice big flame off of them. Uh, now, the first trick is the hardest trick to see. I'm just going to light the palm of my hand on fire very, very briefly. So there'll be a small candle flicker just on the palm of my hand. Uh, and then after that, everything else is way more visual. So here we go. No, not, uh, okay, that's all right. I've got better if you don't like that one. Check this one out. It's very similar. Whoop. Ow. One more. Okay, this one's a lot better. <laughs> Folks, this next one I'm going to do is I'm going to touch the burning torch to my unlit tongue very briefly, letting my tongue on fire, and touch the unlit torch to my lit tongue very uh, quickly, letting the unlit torch off my lit tongue. Hopefully that sounds all right. If it doesn't make sense, that's okay. The trick looks way better than it sounds. So here we go. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> Thank you guys very much. Now, I am going to do a couple more for you, but I'm going to dose them in fuel again so we get like a nice, nice big flame out of them, okay? Uh, and the next tricks I'm going to do for you guys are... Uh, First of all, my most dangerous trick, and uh, then my most difficult trick with the fire-eating torches, and then uh, I'll actually eat the fire for you. 
Uh, now for the first one, the most dangerous fire trick that I do with these fire eating torches, I'm going to take the burning torch, bite down on it, and leave it freestanding in my teeth for just a few seconds. Sorry? Oh, thank you. I thought I heard my mom in the crowd there for a second. <laughs> All right, okay, here we go. Here we go. Most dangerous fire eating trick. Here we go. <laughs> oh. Whew, thank you. Uh, so the next one, the most difficult fire eating trick that I do, I'm going to take the burning torch. I'm going to hold it just above my mouth and very, very carefully suck in some of the unlit vapors off the bottom of the torch, filling my mouth with flammable vapors. As these vapors slip out of my mouth, there's going to be a small candle flame coming off my bottom lip, and then I'll push the whole thing out at the same time, making a small fireball that'll go up just to below the ceiling and light the other torch. In saying that, I'm going to take a step to my right. Here we go. Awesome. <laughs> All right, thank you guys very much. Last trick for you today beneath the torches. Here we go, torch number one. And now torch number two. And just to really unite us all as a crowd, to, make, to get like a big, big, huge round of applause just for the last trick that I'm doing for you. Um, if you could do me a favor and give me a huge round of applause right when the torch goes in my mouth, that would be perfect, okay? We'll try this right now. Here we go. Uh, All right, that was a bad joke. Here we go. For real this time. Ooh, awesome. Fantastic. Thank you guys very, very much. I hope you guys enjoyed the, uh, the short show. My name is Cobbler J. And uh, that's my set. Thank you guys very much. Yeah.